then you're deciding, you say, I want to do a Toronto draft. Yeah, one. slam the garbage bin down when I throw out the bagel, but it's a little bit dramatic. Yeah. There you go. So I've heard it's one of the most hardest physical things you can yeah. do. I'm a very extreme person, so, yeah, yeah, so rather than I'm going to get into shape, I say I'm going to do a try one. Sweet. Uh, for the swim, I don't know. Michael's an excellent swimmer. He's obviously a very coordinated guy. He's five lessons in. He's already got his hand position in a nice position. He's going to get he's a bit more balanced as he does more of it. Where you, where's your swimming at? Where do you feel that? At the flow. It's <laughs> yeah. um, shoulder flexibility is going to be a big issue. That would start with when you get to the pool. So if you're doing arm swings as you get there, not that like crazy windmilling you might see some people doing. It's a very just slow approach to like a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. So just think in that linear plane, like if I grab water here, I anchor the water and I pull myself past it, I don't pull water past me. Does that make sense? He started doing a bit of drills and he said he felt like he was on the comedy network, but you know, baking down the strokes into streamlining and, and breaking down into a feel for the water is important. Um, I think he's going to do fine there. He's going to have a wetsuit. We told him to get a pair of fins, those Aquasphere molded fins that give you a little bit of buoyancy are fantastic. <laughs> this is going to be your, your bang for your buck though, for right. fitness wise. Especially as a person with this video. You're a dad, you've got business to run. To be able to put your head in the water and nobody can talk to you, right. it's a blessing.